Okay, you think the world's getting crazier and scarier and more threatening? Here's evidence. Horns growing out of the heads of teenagers. It's hard to believe this is actually happening, but researchers in Australia say it is. They say they've discovered small bone spurs growing from the back of skulls on teens who are heavy mobile phone users, which would be basically everybody who's a teen. Dr. Mark Siegel is a Fox News medical contributor. He joins us frequently on this show to sort out mysteries like this one. We're happy to have him tonight. Doctor, thanks for coming on. Is this real? Tucker, this is real. Not only are we seeing alienation and anxiety and depression from frequent use of smartphones and too much screen time, we're also seeing physical changes. We're seeing blurry vision, headaches. We're seeing something called text neck, where your muscles of your neck get weakened. And guess what happens when your muscles get weakened? Your body responds by making more bone, and it's making these external occipital protuberances called inium bumps that are spurs that are growing at the back of our heads, especially teens. And guess what else? They're going to be transmitted to the next generation by something called epigenetics. So if you got one, your kid's going to get one. And it really shows what we're doing to ourselves. We're transforming into a new being because of all the time we're spending watching things rather than interacting face to face with someone. Is it, is it possible? So, I mean, if teens are getting these protuberances, by the time they're my age, 50, could they, I mean, they'll be visible, presumably, right? And you can feel them. It's right here in the middle of your head. I happen to have one, by the way. My daughter doesn't, but she will have one in a couple of years. I'm watching her for this. And they're growing to larger than an inch now in these studies. So literally, we're going to be able to identify people. This is how we're going to say hello. Instead of shaking hands, we're going to be feeling to see if you have this spur in the back of your head from too much screen time. It's really part of this Rubbing terrible- Rubbing horns like- Animals. <laughs> Will we shed them ever? Or are they permanent? They're permanent. They're growing. They're helping us, by the way, to keep our muscles tied to our heads. So they have a purpose, but they're going to be transmitted. And your, your kids are going to have them, your grandkids are going to have them, and they're going to get larger and larger the more screen time we have. But I have a prescription here, Tucker. I want us to go out to dinner with each other, not bring our smartphones, yes. to exercise, to talk to each other, to Amen. hug each other. Maybe the spurs will shrink if we go back to hugging each other. <laughs> our horns will go away. Dr. <laughs> Siegel, great to see you tonight. Thank you for that wise advice. Thank you, Tucker. Thank you.